Hi everyone, this is Tom Mason and I have another Power School video tip for you. I've seen a lot of teachers who it gets to be the end of a marking period and then they go and they enter a bunch of assignments to sort of get caught up you know before the uh, next marking period starts. But there's a problem that can happen when you do that and I just wanted to make a video to show you that right now. So you just want to be aware of this at the end of the year or at the end of a semester. So right now I'm in S1 which in my test school that's semester one a reporting term for the first part of the school year I want to make a new assignment as though I'm just getting caught up entering all of my assignments before the end of the semester so let's say this was an exponent quiz in this math class category is quiz uh, points possible 100 points and then I'm gonna save it now I saved my assignment but you'll notice that it's not shown here in this assignments view so where did it go? Well, it's under S2, which is the current semester, and there it is right here. The reason that this occurs is that PowerSchool's gradebook will always put date due as the current system date on your computer. So that means even though I was entering it under S1, it doesn't really matter. It gets filtered according to the date and appears in S2. So make sure when you're entering a new assignment that you change the due date to be something that was within that that uh, semester and then it will show up in the right place so now I changed it back to October 10th and if I switch to S1 the assignment appears there so to do that from the beginning click on the plus to create a new assignment and then right away make sure the due date is set to something in the semester in which you're working that way it'll appear then you can create a name put whatever you need save it and it will go into the right place so that's it. Just remember to keep your dates correct when you're entering things late into the semester so that it doesn't get bumped into the following semester by mistake. So again, my name's Tom Mason, and you can subscribe for more cool videos for useful power school tips. You can also follow me on Twitter by looking in the link uh, in the description beneath this video. Thanks for your time.